thank you for staying with us. You're still watching your favorite channel that is at Y254. And the, our hashtag is Y in the morning or WCW. Are you crushing on somebody? Let us know. Give him a shout out. Give him some love this morning. Mm -hmm. My name is Valentine or at Kalumi Val everything. And Kastoma. I have a surprise for you. Nasi kwa bad. Kuna dem flani hapa mechanganya wanaume. Hadi set likuwe imeja for a few minutes. And I was quite confused. In fact, on that note, please, I think ni maomoka kwa hii camera. So if you see me in person, <laughs> and I don't look like this, or I don't have makeup, I look like a five-year-old, please, please don't be angry, okay? Yeah, just lower expectation a bit. But we will custom at a effect. At a chok, kidogo too, but it's, it's a good type of chok. Good morning, hashtag is, yeah, yeah, my person. Thank you, my personal person, for just mulikering on her. What's good, Shori? You look nice. Thank you, thank you. Please thank introduce yourself you. to the thank masses. You. <laughs> Hi guys, what's popping? What's <laughs> happening? <laughs> Welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> yes, thank you so much, Val, for having me <laughs> on your show. I really, really appreciate. Mm -hmm. Yes. What's your name? My name is Tracy Waitera, mm -hmm. or TW. TW is my brand, or I'm a brand. Yes. Hey. Sort of. <laughs> we are so sorry. How yes. can we find you, Tina? You should be. You should be. You should <laughs> you be. You are full of sass. <laughs> I'm going to have fun with this. I'm going to have fun with this. Mm -hmm. uh, how can we find you on social media? Um, my social media handles is at Tracy Way there at Instagram, Tracy Way there in Twitter, Tracy Way there in Facebook, Tracy mm -hmm. Way there everywhere. Mm -hmm. In a mm. nutshell, surely that that smile has maintained. <laughs> you gotta teach me how to keep it. Mm. I'll show you. Uh -huh. I'll show you. I'll show Tips. you. Teeth out. Mm. December teeth out. Pesa kidogo chaza kutoa mene. All right, tell me about yourself. Help me understand who who T W is. Who Tracy White there is. Um, Tracy White there is um, a young woman. Mm -hmm. Who was one day a young girl, mm -hmm. a young girl still trying to strive, uh, to thrive each and everything that comes her way, trying to um, do each and everything that she may achieve her goals, trying to study, do each and everything that comes her way, whether good or bad, <laughs> just for me to have whatever that I want in life. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. TW is a brand that I started um, not long ago because i think i just discovered that i'm a brand mm -hmm. like a niago mm -hmm. why did i discover i'm a brand it's because i'm really motivated when i feel that people really own their story so for me i believe that i own my story i own my my story like i can tell you my story and i'm like whether you take it positively or negatively that remains to be my story mm -hmm. whether it's good or bad to you, you i get like that? that yes they said somewhere that apparently in at least one story out there in the world, you're going to be the bad guy. Of course. Even if you do, did your absolute best, yes. even if you did everything right, either way, you're still going to be the bad guy in someone's story. And imagine that's okay. Don't go kill yourself. Yeah, it's, it's okay, okay. okay. right? Yeah. So now, what does a brand mean to you? Does that mean now you, you are verified in all the social media platforms? Uh, that, really. Does that mean when we talk to you, we have to sit to W at Peter Tracy. Like, what does brand mean? Do you have merchandise? Do you have paraphernalia? Do you have mm. cool things that I can wear and show you <laughs> off? That's where I'm going with this. Do you? Yes, I do have merchandises. Mm -hmm. I have hoods. I have hoodies. <gasps> I have t-shirts. Okay, I want. Leone kind of customer. But I don't care. I will support. Continue. Yes, I do have some merchandise of TW brand. A brand is something enthusiastic. A brand is you. Mm -hmm. What do people see when you walk? How do people define you when you're just walking or just coming in in the studio? What are people seeing when right now you're seated right there? Mm -hmm. That's a brand. A brand is like you. You, your enthusiasm, your qualities, your personality. What do people talk about you when you leave a certain room? Mm -hmm. What do they say? Val is a very hardworking woman. They have already branded you as a hardworking woman. Mm -hmm. A brand is something that is working mm -hmm. or just something that can be described in a simple word. Mm -hmm. You get? For example, right now, you don't have to be told that Uhuru Kenyatta is the president when he walks here. Mm -hmm. You already know mm -hmm. because that's how he was branded. Mm -hmm. 
You don't have to be told that Val is a presenter. You already see her on TV each and every morning, mm -hmm. each and every afternoon, each and every evening. So that's a brand. Well, let me first claim that. Woo! Give me all that airtime. <laughs> Lord, amen. Continue. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's a brand. For you to discover that you are a brand, you need to know of how you dress, how you walk, how you talk to people, how you address issues, how you advise people, how you motivate people, how you don't motivate them. You need to know your weaknesses, your strengths. You need to know you. Are you really, really that person who I can call at any time and talk to? Those are some of the qualities for you to know that you are a brand. Mm -hmm. A brand is somebody who I can just be seated right here and while somebody will call you and tell you, Yo Val, I'm in a problem. Tell me how to go about it. Mm -hmm. Just tell me. Mm. They never chose to call Tracy. They chose to call Val. Mm -hmm. Why? Because to them you're a brand. A brand of, you can give me something positive. You can just give me a positive vibe. You can just hype my emotion up. Mm -hmm. You know? That I can like do. Like that. Yes. <coughs> I am a cheerleader. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. There are a lot of things that come with being a brand or with trying to portray yourself in a certain way. It could mm -hmm. be quite effortless, but there's some things maybe that we want to, I don't know if I want to say improve on ourselves yeah. or tunajaribu kutaka kukuapa, but we're not quite there yet. I don't know if it's faithing it till you make it or faking it till you make it, but there is a curve, you know, and, and with the person I am today, I am not who I was yesterday. And at a growth it's still different. Mm -hmm. So maybe the next time I see someone who's been away for six months, maybe at Anijua, because I've constantly and I am intentionally changing. But social media and mami, hmm? Well, mm -hmm. yeah, take me back, Dubai, yes, whoa, yes. Sijui, I vacation, oh, nga, yes. oh, cars, Sijui, five cars. As in, it's 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 ridiculous, you know. Yeah. We're trying to trust the process, yes. but also, you know, you you want to see things. You want to see, eh, what wanna behave, mm -hmm. Does a brand mean copying what somewhere else is doing, or? Or maybe if I would use the two of us for an example, let's say we're two separate brands, yeah. but there's something about you that I like and there's something about me that you like. Is there a space where we can, you know, coexist? Can we do things together without the pressures for Udem? Yeah, sure. be a spotlight. But the spotlight is big, that's why it's called sport, see torch. Mm -hmm together <laughs> yeah yes. so help me work this out it's it's somewhere between envy it's somewhere between you know y you kind of feel helpless you want to be there but you're not there just because you've forgotten about the process just for a bit not a long time just okay. a bit. so walk me through that kind of situation for me well I think our life is a process where I started it's not where I am today I started working when I was at the age of eight, of 17. Mm -hmm. That I was in form three. Because, you know, I had to, like, hustle my school fees out and help my mama pay my school fees. Really? Yes. And I had to do things like sales and marketing, selling lines at archives, the way you see ladies just standing somewhere, doing brand ambassador work in the supermarkets. You stand a whole day selling sanitary towels, wearing like a dress written a certain brand. You're trying to tell people more about that certain brand that you're selling for you to get something little that you can take back home. So to me, I think that life is not how I copy Val. Life is not how I try and do things the way Val does. I believe that life is how I do best. Because if I try and copy you, Val, I will never have the same goals as Val has. My goals are totally different from yours. They might be the same, but how you will achieve them and how I will achieve them, that will be totally different. Because, you know, for example, um, we have social media influencers, right? Mm -hmm. Somebody who like, you'll just open your social media and you'll be like, my goodness, I want to be like this certain lady. <laughs> Kit actress had a photo shoot the other day, yes. I almost cried. Actually <laughs> now, so Kit good. actress to me is like now a mentor to me. <laughs> you know? Send your swag. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Like, but now for Kit actress, I love her because she so, as, as in, she will tell us step by step about the process. Mm -hmm. You know, she will take us back and show us she did not just start somewhere and boom, she's on Netflix. Mm -hmm. 
she did not just start and just went like that. Mm -hmm. She did not just wake up and then the next morning she was at 1.2 million followers. Mm -hmm. She did not. She has a process that she follows. There is somewhere Alipitia. She had to go for a million auditions like we do. Oh, and the nose. Yes. Why the nose? You have to like ah. get out your oomph in front of judges. And one judge is like, you know what? You don't even know how to act. Oi. I'm um, to in year two, they decide you're an extra. Yes. Don't even give you time exactly. of day. Exactly. Or even you're just given one line to say, ah, we're Kwenda. Can you imagine getting such a line? And I say, my cup, Papa Jones. Kwenda! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I will say it with that. Give me one line. I Kwenda! <laughs> okay, I'm done. Yes, exactly. So, Val, I believe that life is a process. And you really need to, str to trust your process. Because if I try and follow people's life, how they live, how they work, how they do things ca categorically, you will really suffer. Because they did not just wake up and find themselves there. And remember, Val, if God says that your door, is, today I'm just going to walk on Val's door, and your blessings will be tomorrow, nobody will touch them. If God says it's Val, it's Val. Mm -hmm. If Anasema, you know what? I think Val has ever helped somebody it's out making there. making me feel nice. Yeah. My heart. Uh -huh. God will certainly come to your door. So I always say that blessings... It's just like something so mysterious or something so amazing because you may just sleep, you're wondering of how you will just make it in this life. Then God does, yo, well, just here. Yeah. But did you tap you into know? my thoughts? I have sleepless nights sometimes, wondering what, what I'm doing. Everybody does. Like, where am I going? Yes, exactly. What's going on here? Yeah. And even wondering, oh my goodness, all these certificates, and then the other person is like looking... My goodness, my mama cannot even afford my school fees. So you're two different people. One is looking at all the certificates without a job. The other person is looking at how the parent cannot even afford school fees to take you to a university or even a college. Two different situations. Mm -hmm. The person who never even goes to school or something lands him or herself a very good job. The person with certificates and all, everything, the person lacks. Mm -hmm. Or even the vice versa. Mm -hmm. So that's why I say that God's timing is always the best. Mm -hmm. And you need to wait. You know, the problem with us human beings, including me, patience. <sighs> and then you make the mistake of praying and asking for patience. And then you, you put in situations. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> to yes. help you understand what you're asking <laughs> <Exactly>. for. <laughs> yes, so sometimes we lack that patience of like believing that maybe one day I will be. Maybe one day I will be like what I dreamt of years ago. Maybe in the next five years I will be at a certain level that right now I'm not. Maybe when I reach at this particular moment I will be this and this and this and this. You get? Mm. So whatever you need to have is a lot of patience and believing in yourself. Because while you will expect a lot of people to believe in you, and the only people who will come are maybe it's your mama or your dad, and you have a million friends, mm -hmm. they don't believe in you. Mm -hmm. You can imagine. If you follow the mob, you're lost. Mm -hmm. If you decide to follow that one person, then you're cool. Mm -hmm. But if you follow that one person, there'll be consequences. The mob will try and judge you, mm -hmm. give you insinuatives. Each and every time that you're walking, they will either say something positive or negative but mostly negative about you mm -hmm. so it all depends by how did i take it as val how did i take it as tracy where is it even leading me you get mm. sometimes we're all influenced even with our friends we find ourselves doing things that we never imagined ourselves we will do mm -hmm. but, you're like okay yeah, and the funny thing is, we usually judge. We usually ju judge. Woo! Yes. How many people have I judged in my life? And <laughs> as I have been living that life, I yes. too, just doing the things I used to judge. I'm like, okay, yes. now I'm easy. Exactly. So it really needs that. Uh, you need to like always motivate yourself mm -hmm. because if you're just waiting each and every time to be motivated by other people, you, you tend to get lost. Mm -hmm. We really tend to get lost. Mm -hmm. If somebody told me one day, you know. Me being somewhere like here, it was once a dream. Mm -hmm. When I'm just in class, failing my biologies and chemistries. <laughs> 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 failing my biologies and chemistries. I can see you. You're just guessing, yeah. Sciences. <laughs> failing all those sciences. Sometimes uh -huh. I was like, you know what? I just wish that one day I would be on a TV just being interviewed or me doing an interview to someone. Mm -hmm. She get? does those, by the way. Yes. We'll get to that shortly. <laughs> mm -hmm. Exactly. So sometimes 
we pray for things but because they did not come like that first how we wanted we feel bad and that bad that we feel the guilt that we feel that what makes our blessings to be delayed mm -hmm. because we we are really tending to be like i know ah manze elisha and anger i always make i always make mm. whatever we possess with our mouths it really works a hundred percent sure it really works whatever you possess with your mouth mm -hmm. this it's very tricky mm -hmm. but whatever that you command with your mouth too it can certainly happen at a yani you just blink and open it happens and i could jongelesha kwangu after this <laughs> hashtag is in the morning yes. i want to talk about your other project that you haven't really brought to light maybe we can talk about that and then because i know time is done, i'm going to look at the time and it's going to be over yeah. let's just first do that okay so um about tw there is the last thing i did not mention tw has a foundation mm -hmm. a foundation of helping the needy in the community mm -hmm. mostly um right now it's not that ongoing like a big project it's just a small project that um i just started like months ago but why are you downplaying it it's such a big deal like you please it let's is. celebrate <laughs> you yes thank you yeah hmm. so uh, the problem okay not the problem or the good thing or why i really i maybe looked at that sector for me to be where i am i've had people acting as stepping stones in my life so yeah i want to act as a stepping stone to somebody out there I like that. Yeah. That's deep. Yeah. I interviewed the once reigning Ngoja Miss World Kenya. Yes. 1999 to 2000. Mm -hmm. And she came and, and she first dropped a lot of wisdom. Please go check that interview out at mm -hmm. Wet54 channel on YouTube. But my favorite thing about what she said or something that I took home with me is the name of her song. It's never too late. It's never too late to anything. I mean, really. <laughs> we are refusing to go to school, but Jalango Amerudi Shulendo will graduate. Congratulations, exactly. Uncle Jalas. It's never too late to maybe even change your career. If, if you've been a doctor all your life, you don't a DJ, bro. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Go yeah. ahead. It's never too late. Mm -hmm. Is that something that you're also feeding into the people that you are working with in the community? Uh, whatever that I say, and it's something in me so much, always be that person who wakes up every day with that mindset of achieving. Because if you have that mindset of achieving each and every day that you wake up, whatever that your heart wants, you will go that way. Mm -hmm. If you know you always work each and every day, like day in, day out as a doctor, but you feel that your heart really loves DJing, mm -hmm. you will wake up with that heart of achieving, you will go mix those songs. <laughs> no, she makes collab. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> exactly. So when I say that, every day you wake up with a very positive mindset and a mindset of achieving, that's all. Because if you wake up with a mindset of achieving, whatever that your heart feels like, and you already have that mind of achieving it, you will do it. Mm -hmm. But if you won't have that mindset of achieving anything, you'll only be there just because you're there. Usha ishi because uko tu. Hata kuna moment mtu pata kwa life too. Yaani unamkaga tu ende tu job juu tu unaenda. You can. Hmm. But it's because life is, is has pushed you to that particular corner. And you as well has you have like umeitikia tu kukaa kwa hiyo corner. You get? Hmm. So sometimes we get ourselves in different positions in life not because we want. It's because some circumstances in life they force us to be there. Mm -hmm. So what makes you get out of that particular position? Mm -hmm. You will get a lot of criticism, but sometimes it's good to amua, mm. amua too. Mm. It's very good to just make up your mind and do you, just do you. I think you're my spirit animal. Apo kwa do you, mm. do you, and and yeah. motivates sana sana jipende. In conclusion, mm -hmm. I want to state categorically that i am such a big fan of whatever is happening in this here world concerning mental health and the constant awareness that before first of all black people could not talk to people yeah, uh, shrink because sure. you can't talk to a psychologist or psychiatrist <laughs> exactly. because you're black i love for boy child but i don't think we put a lot of emphasis on on how the cognitive process works on the rest of us you know if, if i'm down all the time or if i'm being hard on myself which i do a lot i am my worst critic so if that's happening in my head then meeting you i might not get all the 
oomph, do you understand? Yeah. Like if you were about to change my life in a certain way, miraculously, or if yeah. you were about to tell me something that would have sparked an idea in my head, it ani pita tu ivo. Exactly. It sijui as if couch potato. Like is this? <clears throat> do you think that we should add volume, for lack of a better phrase, to mental health awareness? Yes, we should. Um, apart from doing TW and everything, I'm a motivational speaker, Loki. Mm -hmm. So I've met like different people in my life, even my age mates, even older than me. I'm so young. So, um, yeah. <laughs> See how you slid that in there? <laughs> yes. So um, <laughs> I've met like ladies who are in different relationships, mm -hmm. who currently they're in relationships, but they suffer from domestic violence. Oh. Yes, hmm. very. But when you sit down with them, the reason they will tell you that they are staying in that particular relationship is because their boyfriend has given me somewhere to stay, their boyfriend has given me some... Yes, we do understand sometimes those are needs because maybe you don't want to go back to your payroll, maybe you don't even have parents. So it criticizes you or it clicks into your mind that you, be ha you, you start having mental disorder. Because, you know, you, you start looking so down onto yourself, you know, that each and every time I'm around people, people talk about all oh, positive things. The only thing that I have to talk about mm -hmm. is how my life is not going straight. It gives you mental disorder. Mm -hmm. Whatever that happens, when you get like such a thing or such a case to handle, I always tell people, like, I always even tell you, Val, you're in an, a relationship. You're having domestic violence in that relationship. Nadanyo? No, you have no kid. You have a talent. Mm -hmm. You have a dream. You have a goal to achieve. Mm -hmm. Then that's on you. Mm -hmm. State to me your goals. You tell me da 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 da. But that's a whole other topic because I guess it's the fear of being alone. Let me tell you, oh. Val, something. Mm. If you fear being alone, mm. then you'll never have peace. Mm. And peace of mind is expensive. Enjoy. <coughs> before you start enjoying my company, Niki Kuita Tuwake, mm. first enjoy yours. <laughs> Jare, you have stopped reggae. Yes. You have stopped it. Hey, Ati. <coughs> you have fun when you have those earphones on. Kwa nyumba, kwa hao, umeka volume yote. We are friends. Then go so on, have it. From now on, we are friends. Yes, okay? thank you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Before you start adi yoku enjoy company ya watu wengine, sometimes it, is, it happens that you feel you're so down val, that you just at home and you're like, manze, I really need to just call somebody. Yani ya kamtu tukaituna yeye. You see, that loneliness, which is cool. Mm -hmm. It's cool to be lonely. Mm -hmm. I say it's cool. How is it cool, Shari? It's cool to be lonely because you will never lack a time in life that you're lonely even the president one day and as I say I'm going to school but then you're lonely you will never <laughs> write a book please <laughs> all my instagram no, you can't work captions. maybe you used your yes exactly uh-huh yes so for me I always say sometimes you just need to like enjoy your company. Uh -huh. You need to. Because if you don't, utakuagatu no goja tu watu tu yani mkam wakwetu na wewe. And the moment you wait for people to be always there for you, you will never make a personal decision in your life. Mm -hmm. You'll only be making decisions out of influence or be making good decisions because you have a good company. You get? Mm. So it's very difficult for you to tell me that you, you, you can't stay lonely. You need, like it happens. <laughs> Who needs to hear this? Yes. Who out there needs to hear this? Mm -hmm. Why do you think people say that I just want a long drive oh. car alone? Uh -huh. Why? Maybe they are always around people. Mm -hmm. They don't have that alone time. Now, they have been all around people that Adi Sahiwa call like, eh, I need my alone time. Mm -hmm. Have you ever stayed around people and then you're like, I think my goals ain't even straight, man. <laughs> You're just hearing other people's voices in your yes. head. Yours has disappeared. Exactly. Like, bro, why did they commute? Rudy, Rudy. You, what, what's, what's happening? Mm. You're like doing decisions, doing things because people are doing them. You've never made a personal decision. It's because you like to give yourself some mental time. Just your time. You know, it's good to have your time. Think about your goals. That even right now when I come and ask you, where do you want to be in five years? You will stay to me, da, 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 da in like a whole, just a one paragraph. But if you just, 
you make your head like a cocoon when i ask you where do you want to be like in such a particular time you don't know kesho siko job ni kuja kuchesa we are friends <laughs> we'll exchange those emails <laughs> speaking of which please do tell us if you have not already I, I, you have entertained me i must might have gotten if you told us your social media handles uh -huh. sana sana i want you to double a bit on your youtube channel and what you do mm -hmm. and then maybe we can work towards wrapping this up i think we have around roughly five minutes okay on my youtube channel it's tracy way there something up is coming on my youtube channel mm. so keep it locked on Instagram, it's Tracy Waitera, TW. On Facebook, it's Tracy Waitera. Twitter, Tracy Waitera. Mm -hmm. Yes. My favorite thing that I've come to cling on to very tightly is laughing at myself. Like, I have a job, I have a Val, I have a job. I have a job. I have a And then, has it uh, paid any of your bills? No. No, Val. Haya. Has it fed you? No. no. In fact, kwanza una in the kitchen kuona ingredients, <laughs> si chakula. So it's a nice struggle. Yes. Ah, just laugh at yourself, Nani. Laugh exactly. at yourself. It's very therapeutic and don't take yourself too seriously. I we'll, love to appreciate we'll those we'll steps. Die. Where mm. you are, it's a very good step. Like it's yeah. a big step. You should mm. appreciate each and every little step. Mm -hmm. Yes, I really do. Mm, but she's I think we've hosted each other. Sioni kama nimekuwa host peke yangu. Now I remember host there peer but he host but we gel to for Okay, what would you in conclusion like to tell the people who are now your very biggest fans and are looking up to you or just kind of want to do what you're doing? Okay. I um what I will say is that um thank you so much my fans. Yeah, thank you mono. And um if you're looking up to me like maybe I'm your mentor or something, that, that I really it. appreciate. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. try and do things better that I'm doing. Like try and do better. Try and push it harder than maybe more than I'm doing. I like that. Yes. Where were you? Like when I was trying to find friends who think like me? Yeah, I am. Those contacts 07. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> Not to Yes. Hey, man, say to Omoke. It's a must. To Omoke. That mindset of Komoka, 100% each and every day. When you're waking up and when Fall. you're sleeping. Yes. yes. <laughs> All right. You know what to do. Yes. Like, don't do anything. Just stay with us. <laughs> At Word by Four Facebook, Word by Four channel on a Twitter hashtag is Wine the or WCW. We just had the phenomenal Tracy Why there. And I think I just made a new friend, guys. Yay! It's good when you come to work, isn't it? Yes. Very, very productive <laughs> morning. But we still do have a conversation waiting in a bit. And we have a question on our social. So please do go answer. Give us a penny for your thoughts. So just tell us good morning. Amo salimi amutu. Yeah, let us keep you warm in this weather. Are we together? Mm. Yeah, and it's for free. Hashtag why in the morning. Don't go away. <laughs>